This is a canoe or crew in a camp, my no. Alright guys, so this will be probably episode three of the bodybuilding deal. And I'm gonna rewind that because I didn't even tell you who I was or what we're doing. What's playing tonight? Welcome to the old number seven garage. This is Tim coming at you. Brian back there running the camera. Today, we're going to try to get the nose plastic on. Uh, all kinds of fun stuff. Think we get the whole thing done? Uh, maybe. Probably not. Probably not. But anyway, thanks for stopping by and watching the videos. Uh, you guys really showing the love there and we appreciate it. So make sure to drop a like on this video if you like what you're seeing. Hopefully it'll help you out. Without further ado, let's get to it. I was looking at some other guy's stuff. What they're doing is putting this here on the outside and then you know how we can pull this back because it's just bolted right there and there's some room they're, they're pulling that apart and putting the plastic between the sheet metal here on the back side on the sides and then running this on the front mm -hmm. That's what I was thinking too. So what I was thinking about doing is cutting that down Because we already got it all taped off So I just ran a tape line Just to give me something straight to go off of and I'll cut down here but I think we should cut that off and lay it up there and see. What are you doing? You watching video? Uh -uh. What are you looking at? Oh, he's eyeballing some stuff. Yeah. See what I'm saying now? Yeah. They're kind of doing the same. Mm -hmm. And I think that works pretty good. Or did you get you some, take uh, you some pictures while you was out of town? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. I see. This guy here has been going out of town a little bit on me. So he's really holding up progress on this video stuff. Yep. Anyway, we'll get the old, uh, what do you think we ought to cut that with? That buzz saw or the angle grinder or what? Probably the air saw. Seems to cut it pretty good. What about, what about, I got a brand new cutoff wheel. That would work too. Or jigsaw. Jigsaw works pretty daggum good. good. I want it to be as straight as possible. So whatever we can do to get in that, let's get set up. <laughs> Broke the dang tap off of it. I don't think so on plastic. You did. What? See it? See it right there? Oh yeah. Broke tip right off of it, sitting right there. See that? I see that several lines in there, see? Oh man. Sucker? Oh, you better save that. You know we're gonna use this mug, the long one. That's going. That's going right here. I'm getting rid of this. He's busted. Uh, busted. Come on. What do you think? Hey, that looks pretty good, doesn't it? Get your router out. Mm, oh yeah. Put a biscuit joint on it. Mm, How'd that look for an edge? Is that <clears throat> real white? I don't mind that. You know, you can take and heat that up, and that gets rid of that white. You have to go out from underneath. Well, this one ain't. Well, what about this? What about this? Let me see if I can do with some, uh, if I can cut this good. We'll just practice up here. If I can get this good, of course, that'll be easy. See what it looks like. Still a little bit white, but I think I just cut that. Gotta get that fourth rib down torque. Yep. You know what I mean? 
really push on it. You go right ahead and do that. I'm working on it. It's good! That doing an okay job, boss? You bet. Real nice. She's a beaut. It's a little clean up. Got Brian Vila here. <laughs> <laughs> he He's a woodworking master. You bet. Don't even let him get... wood. Well, I'm here, you interrupted me abruptly oh. there. Abruptly? Abruptly, interruptly. Like real quick. It's a fast. You, you ought to see him on plastic. He's real good with wood. <laughs> ah, whatever. That's that's. I don't think you could do that any better if you paid somebody. Middle of winter, short sleeve t-shirt. I mean, it's not hot, but it's compared to what it has been. It's just a little bit warmer than sweater weather, right? Yeah. It's not sweater weather, no. but you got a sweater on. Well. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try to do this one. How's that work? Yeah, get that force yeah. rib dig in there. You gotta right. get that force rib dig in there, hey, son. Come here. Hey, Dad, you have to wash this. Wash this. Bound to be perfect. Hey, watch this. <laughs> that was a little tall, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter? Oh, he got her started. Hey, you gotta watch this, Dad. Oh, my ribs. Hey, Dad, you gotta watch this. Oh, there it went. That was my wrist Dad, breaking away. That was your ribs? Hey, Dad, my wrist breaking away. <laughs> I think you got a little bit more bite than you can handle there. There ain't no good way to do this. Just grab that sucker and fold it up, Hulk. Hulk a maniac! Terrible. Show him, turn it in stuff. Nope. I don't think you cut enough. You're a liar. Hey, what about. Good grief. Let me have it. Here, you hold it. Daddy, that's great cards. I know that. What about hey, that? You good. <laughs> like metal can you just keep doing this and it possible nope uh-uh get my super blade out oh yeah watch your digits that's it oh we gotta keep that. tearing that up i ain't tearing that up Oh yeah, I'm happy with that. Mm -hmm. Alright. Get that fourth rib big in there again. Oh, you pinching mother! Don't do that though. Gotta hold your mouth just right, I guess. I'll let it dig in. Oh, I'll let it dig in. Am I fired, boss? Nah, you got it. I mean, I'd pay for that. Yep, look at that edge. Be perfect length. Gonna work? Yep. Oh yeah. Give it, it makes it make that pop, you know what I mean? Yeah. Make it pop. I think that'll work. Well, moment of truth here, we got all of our stuff cut. Like we tell you, you measure once and cut twice. And you'll be wrong every time. Alright, so I'm going to have to set you down. See if we can get going on here. We have decided the jury was that we uh we normally put rivets in these i think you're gonna bolt them 
because we can have pretty good, you know, the bolts we use with washers are like, got him, about like that big. And uh, I think we're just gonna put maybe a, two bolts here, two bolts on that one, and then we'll get the center piece in there, but we wanna know we got this right where we want it. And you know, you put this over top of it, you can't see what the heck you're doing. First thing we're gonna do is get that secured. Got a nice little taper down through there. We'll probably wind up ripping this thing off first lap, but boy, it'll look good for pictures. Her battery's dead, bud. Bring a unit. I can't hit the hole, bud. I love it, bro. Not personal, though. <clears throat> I, I mean, I got it. I don't even got the machine. I don't know about that. What? Uh, you got one of them 90 degree sockets? No, I ain't found one yet. Yeah, they call it a wrench. One of them uh, wrenches. I can't get it, B. I got it. Oh, she's too short. Go long. First scratch. Getting a rip. Drawing it down somewhere. Jed. Clamp it. Hey. I just went an inch and a half. Past it. Somewhere like that. Are you in my way? No. Can't get there. All right, well, there it is. Got him. Oh, uh, oval hole there. Safety bit. Not gonna happen. Well, that's what it's gonna look like, like it or not. I think it'd be okay. Oh, yeah. Yep. So all we gotta do now is get back in there and mark it. Oh, you just you just mark good. It's gotta be a little bit of an angle, doesn't it? Or can you just make that work? No, I mean that'll work. Okay, right. make yeah. that work. We can just cut that right there at that line then. Uh -huh. Okay. I should be able to just go right here to the end of this and mark it for for this cut, which I think I already did almost. Mark it right here, and then we'll just saw this across the area of that line. That'll get us that, and then we can cut this one. Let's see. Right about, right about now. Something like that. Whew. You gotta get that gut on you, you get to make that noise when you lean over. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Don't look at me. Don't me. <laughs> Sorry about all that, guys. You Y'all probably ain't wanting to hear all that. I'm just gonna grab it, fold it up. Go right ahead. I'm gonna fold it up. <clears throat> I ain't gonna think about it. Half and two. Oh, God, this is way thicker though. Come on. I'm just gonna grab it and I'm gonna fold it up. <laughs> I got it started. I think I just got a trolley horse in my neck. I don't know what that was all about. That hurts. I got her going though. I see that. That hurted. Okay, how about this? I'm gonna lay it on here. I'm just gonna fold it up. <laughs> if I was on the edge, it would work. I'm gonna make every excuse I can. <laughs> ah, hey, that worked. <laughs> You gotta make that noise too, because if oh, you don't, I guarantee it. You ain't doing nothing. <laughs> what if I sit on it? Hiya! That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Put your back into it. You can do it. Put your back into it. Stick your finger right there. No. Let me get a hold of it. Not gonna be happening. Watch that Mav TV. Some light miles. Ain't 
ain't not got that anymore. You ain't got no Mad TV? Huh, they've been doing some good late mile racing. Uh, night before last, Mason Ziegler. You want to talk about a race? Golly, him and Bronson. Mm -hmm, back and forth. But that was that was a good race. May have to have Brian Dealer work on that. I'm happy with that. Looks good enough. Looks good and straight. Socks on a rooster. First? No, it's cheating. No, listen. Okay. Well, this is the first fit, right? We ain't been down there, done that's nothing. Not, this is the not. first trial fit. We're, if we're gonna fail together. I'm gonna hold it. All right, I got a hold of it. How bad is it? It don't look bad to me. It fits. It fits. If I can fit. <laughs> it fits. Ha! First time. That don't happen a lot, does it? Yeah. <laughs> it fits, guys. We did it. We did it, we did it. Okay. Well, we're gonna buzz it on there and then we'll let you just stick some eyeballs on it. Got Brian Deal over here. He's gotta finish this up. He just can't take it. That's nice, buddy. You work on wood for a living? No. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. I could watch you do that all day. There won't be nothing left of it all day long. Don't do it very long, yeah, we don't need it. We, we made that right the first time. We don't want to jack that up. Nope. Remember how I said it was nice and warm outside? Well, it is now sweater weather, officially. What are you doing over there, boy? What are you doing over there? You keeping an eye on everybody? Where they at? Get him. You gonna get him. I don't wanna get you. Yeah. Oh, here you go. Finished product. Tell me what you think. I'm laying down on the ground for you guys. We ain't monster trucking no more. No more monster trucking. That's pretty. Better than your money. Orange, you glad we did that, Brian? Oh, yeah. <laughs> if I had a little bit bigger shop, I'd get back and give you a real good shot of it, but I can't. So what we're doing, we're bolting this in. We always have riveted these. You see what I'm saying with this? This bolt's a lot bigger, right? A lot more area to hold. Because these noses take a bunch of abuse. I mean, just ask any modified guy. How many times you been to the track? You see old boy out there, he's got his pretty little nose on there, makes one lap and hot laps and he gone, gone, out of there. So we're just trying to, trying to beef it up. That way we can fold the whole nose up, not just rip the plastic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Completely tear it off, right? Yeah. Not, not just a little bit, but all of it. I, anyway, get all kidding aside, and we also try to get this side here just as close as we can up to the bumper tucked in. And it's good finger width in there. Could have got it a little bit higher up, but it's just that's the way it worked. We got this side pretty high. And then just a little angle down through there. I think it looks pretty good, boys. Pretty good. Coming together. I like that orange on the bottom. I'll make it look real good with that wrap. But that's, uh, <clears throat> if you don't know, I say MD3 nose piece. Comes three pieces there. Real neat looking. I mean, it makes the, in my opinion, makes the noses look way better with that on there. This is the rest of that plastic kit. So they make parts that go, these will go here, around your wheels. And it just really stiffens it up around the doors and the quarters, and then these are the rockers. They go on the bottom of the doors and the quarters. Huh? Oh yeah, let's just show you. So this is my door from last year. So yeah, good man. You're smart. You're a fart smeller. Yeah. There's mom and dad. Hi. But yeah. So there. Now you can see perfect. See, this is their quarter stuff. 
goes right around or their whatever you want to call that wheel well moldings and then your rocker moldings a lot of good stuff coming from that company and uh and we run it so there you go cool stuff well let's get back to it well 545 hours later about two weeks we got her all bolted on honestly it's probably about two hours we had some family come over and some visitors but we just put some bolts in there and then across the front i don't know if i showed that or not but we bolted it all in still got to put some rivets right here where these two join together you can see it part but that's pretty much it pretty much a done deal so tell me what you guys think it's gonna be all we're gonna do today it's getting late supper's about done so give the video a like if you like what you're seeing guys please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever we make a new video so thank you guys so much for tuning in to our channel at the old number seven garage we really appreciate everybody coming by and uh I guess that's going to be it for this video. We uh, spent enough time on that nose for today, so until next time, keep it between the ditches.